beautiful morning, exciting day to be a child of God. Amen. Hallelujah. Well, I'm going to do um, announcements and offering today again and kind of hopefully do a little bit better than last night. I'll give you my testimony, guys, if you're like, what was wrong with Mrs. with uh, Pastor Shauna last night? Um, you know what? This whole, I was going to say Mrs. Jacobs. I was the teacher, you know, <laughs> teacher side, other hat. Um, but uh, no, this past week, you know, I really was feeling um, kind of the weight of all of my responsibilities, right? With ministry, with career, with family, really struggling with juggling everything. And so, Honestly, like even yesterday morning in the service, I was kind of like, oh, you know, I'm just feeling this weight. I'm feeling this heaviness. And uh, when we came last night for service, you know, we're just preparing like normal and everything. And then we go back to the back room to pray. And the presence of God just hit me. You know, I felt kind of like wobbly in my knees. And I just felt like the weightiness of his presence around and just started laughing my head off. You know, it was... Um, and if you've ever heard like my true laugh, it's kind of it's kind of funny. And so it was, yeah, it's kind of like he says like a, like an old British woman is how I laugh, like oh, ho, 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 ho. but uh, <clears throat> so I just started laughing and really, you know, just felt drunk in the spirit most of the night. And so it was pretty, it was pretty awesome, you know, just his joy. Um, and the weight is lifted, thank God, you know, and so I feel like I'm ready now to receive and just to tune into what God is saying um, and just listen for his instruction. You know, if you've been feeling weighed down by responsibilities and that kind of thing, what the Holy Spirit's been ministering to me just in the past, you know, tw I don't know, 20 hours or so is just to... Um, be like Mary, you know, like Mary and Martha, you know, and Jesus said Mary chose the best thing just sitting at the feet of Jesus. I think that if we spend time just tuning into what God is saying to us, that he'll help us with whatever responsibilities we have. You know, I was just thinking this morning about how if, if Martha would have sat down next to Mary, that the meal would have gotten good, would have been taken care of somehow, Right? Like if Jesus had to fly in the lunch with ravens, you know, he's done that before. Right? If he had to rain down the manna from heaven to feed everyone, he's done that before. Right? If he had to have the quail fly over and drop dead at the door, he's done that before. Right? So somehow the lunch would have been taken care of if Martha would have just, you know, sat at the feet of Jesus too. So anyway, if that helps someone, you know, that's what was helping me. Yeah, so 